Hi, I'm Alison Stone, a Professor of Philosophy at Lancaster University. I'm going to tell you a little bit about my current research, which is on women in the history of philosophy. So if you've studied or read about philosophy at all already, you may well have got the impression that it's been entirely done by white European males. The real history of philosophy is a lot more diverse than that. One part of that diversity concerns women. So over the last 20 years, we, that is the community of scholars researching women's contributions to philosophy, we've rediscovered hundreds, if not thousands, of historical women philosophers who got unjustly left out of the canon of great philosophers when it was being formed. Here's a small selection from the particular place and period that I'm researching at the moment, which is 19th century British philosophy. So between them, these women wrote about knowledge and reality, science and evolution, art, religion, the mind and the brain, moral philosophy, many topics in social and political philosophy, including women's rights and the abolition of slavery. So the whole range of philosophical topics. Ironically, lots of these women were really well known in their own time. It's in the supposedly more enlightened 20th century that they got omitted from the canon for complicated reasons. We're now putting them back in. So this is part of the bigger project of diversifying and decolonizing philosophy. It's at the same time about getting a more accurate and rounded picture of the full history of our subject and all those who contributed to it. Well, I hope this conveys that if you come to study philosophy at Lancaster, you'll be in a setting where our research informs our teaching and where staff are actively involved in changing, updating and renewing our discipline, making it more inclusive and as well better philosophically. It's an academically excellent environment and it's also friendly. Lancaster's on a human scale and it's very warm and welcoming. I immediately felt at home when I first came here to work 20 years ago and I'm confident that if you came here you would feel welcomed and at home as well.